Money in the Bank is 11 days away, and we have two new matches of the cards. So let's get to it. First off, the Cruiserweight Championship is on the line as Tony Nese defends against Aria Davari. Uh, Tony, of course, won the title at WrestleMania from Buddy Murphy, and Aria Davari won this opportunity a couple, a couple weeks ago. Uh, of course, Aria Davari being the brother of Sean Davari, or for those that may remember Muhammad Hassan, the Davari that was the manager of Muhammad Hassan. Uh, but I can see this match steal the show on that card. Probably my maybe kick to the uh, bump to the kickoff. I don't know. Probably will. Who knows? But um, it'd be a great match. And I and of course Tony has to retain because I haven't really seen a lot of two hundred five live uh, recently. So I don't know if he's defended it yet. But if he hasn't, he has to have at least a success, a, one successful title defense. That's always the rule in WWE, and it makes sense, because if you're going to be a champion, you don't want to just lose it on your first time defending it. It just makes no sense. But I would not be surprised if Arya wins it in uh, in, a, in a upset of some sorts. This could be a minor upset, some people may think, but I wouldn't be surprised if it happened. And finally, a WrestleMania rematch for the United States Championship, as well as the right to become the face of America, as the current United States Champion and the current face of America, Samoa Joe, defends against Rey Mysterio. Now, um, this match happened at WrestleMania was ironically the shortest match on the card. Probably under a minute, maybe a little over a minute, who knows. But really short match compared to the rest of WrestleMania, and that says something. But with that being said, Dominic will be ringside. And for those who have not seen Dominic Mysterio since the uh, infamous ladder match for custody of Dominic, the legendary match at SummerSlam from Eddie, first with uh, Eddie Guerrero and Ray, great match. Um, Dominic's got fucking big. He's huge. He's bigger than his dad, so that says something. But um, kids growing up, it's fucking crazy to me. I remember he was just a little boy in that storyline of Eddie and Ray innocent little boy and now he's probably in fucking college now jeez I, I feel fucking old I'll, i don't know about you but i feel old as hell but um as far as this match goes i don't know i really don't know because on one hand ray deserves a, a title run of some sorts but joe needs to be the dominant champion that he should be he needs to be that samoan submission machine of old he needs to be that fucking monster of old and I feel that Joe will retain here, but I, I would love Ray to have a run with the U.S. title. I just don't know if it'll happen. But what I do know is Money in the Bank is 11 days away, and there will be more matches of this card. Because, I mean, we had, we had Tag Champions crowned last night. There's a fucking wild card rule, which we'll get to, and we need to get to it. Um, there's so much stuff going on in WWE. That there, there, this could be another WrestleMania caliber card, or at least stacked to have fucking 15, 20 matches. I wouldn't be surprised if that happened, but I don't want to see that personally, but who knows?